Hi, uh, my name is Mary Jo Wallow and I'm the founder of Blue Thong Society. Blue Thong Society came about five years ago on my 50th birthday. Many of you have asked, how did you get that aha moment? How did the idea all come about? Well, I was sitting with a group of girlfriends one night shortly after my 50th birthday and I was sharing with them all the, the incredible great gifts that I had received and I had received a couple of uh, purple and red items and, and I shared with them that there was no way that I was going to wear a red hat, a purple dress and draw attention to myself. And my one girlfriend looks at me and she goes, Mary Jo, she goes, I can't see you with a red hat, but I can see you with a red thong. It was that moment that I, I literally stood up and I said, that's it. We need to start a whole new organization for today's young-minded women like us that, yeah, you know, we're all getting older, what's the alternative, but our attitude does not need to reflect the years that we are. I looked out at all of them, I said, you know what, I'm going to take this idea, I'm going to run with it. I don't know, it may fizzle out in six months, it may turn into something huge, but I really feel it's something worth exploring. Who's coming with me? Well, they all kind of looked at me and, and thought I'd had one too many glasses of Chardonnay, and I had it. So I said, you know, I go, let's, let's put our minds together and see how far this goes. That was five years ago. We just celebrated our four-year anniversary last week on April 1st, 2010. And we are over 5,000 members strong, over 300 chapters strong. And uh, it's just been an amazing ride. One great thing about Blue Thong Society is that not only are we a social group, but we're also philanthropic. Every chapter needs to find a local charity organization preferably in their own backyard uh, to help support and volunteer. Not only are we social, but we're philanthropic, and our recent partner with the Red Cross nationally is also going to give our chapters the opportunity to seek out a local Red Cross chapter to help support and, um, and volunteer for. Recently, we did a survey and we asked our membership, why did you join Blue Thong Society? What keeps you involved? What, um, continues to keep your enthusiasm about Blue Thong Society. The number one reason was the philanthropic aspect of Blue Thong Society. Um, it's amazing when you bring women together um, what you can do. I, I know that when I, before I started Blue Thong Society, I would sit on the couch and watch an ad about Habitat for Humanity, uh, come down and, and help serve the the homeless on a Thanksgiving or Christmas morning and I always said you know what I need to do that but I never did I never did it on my own but when you bring together a group of women Blue Thong Society acts as a catalyst in bringing these women together so that they go out and actually volunteer and do some good in their communities so ladies come join us Blue Thong Society go on to our website at www.bluethongsociety.com you can join either online or download an application. Click on chapters to find a local chapter near you. Or, even better, get a chapter started. Um, I will help you get the chapter going from the, the ground up and, uh, and support you going forward. Thank you very much.